Welcome back to PTL. We are getting a taste of a variety of foods this week thanks to area food trucks. We've been learning the story behind them and about their food. And today we have not one but two trucks <laughs> on the show. So let's head back outside to check in with Selena Pompiani. She is now with Mobile Chef World Fusion. And we already know that you love the food because we saw you before digging the break in. digging in and smiling. <laughs> Oh man, I was chowing down. I had so many bites. It was, I couldn't stop David and Heather. I was eating the mac and cheese with pulled pork. It had pineapple on it. It was a really good combination. So let's hear it from the chef herself, Jamie Gatewood. She is the owner and operator of Mobile Chef World Fusion. This was fantastic, okay. Jamie. Tell Thank me you. about your menu. You have a little bit of everything from all over the world, different cultures. Yeah. So our menu is very diverse, and the reason is we want to bring people together in food and just in every day in the world. So how did this idea come to you? Uh, well, I started the idea of Mobile Chef a long time ago, actually in 2008. I didn't actually get to launch it until about 2017 we started officially. Um, but I went through and got many degrees. I have my degree in hotel restaurant management. Um, I have a degree in culinary arts. And I slowly worked up to this with the help of my father, who James Gatewood, who's been a major help with this business. We actually built this food truck. Yeah. Yeah. Tell me about that. You put a lot of work into this truck. <laughs> this was and it's an, great. Yeah. This was an old plumbing truck. Uh, we gutted <laughs> it. We took everything out of it. I took everything I had, um, you know, from the very beginning. I took everything I had and just slowly. And that's why it took so long. But we're finally here. But great people like Tracy. I want to thank her again for sharing her segment with me. Um, she's been a great uh, friend, best friend, and um, best food truck friend because oh. we travel together, we do everything together. That's great. It's been a great adventure with her, and like I said, my dad, the help from both of them has been tremendous. That's what I wanted to mention, too. So, the reason why we have both Mobile Chef and Mamalicious, you heard her just mention Jamie and Tracy are best friends. They're like sisters at heart. So, you could find them together, right? At most events, almost all are... the time we're together. We travel together, our kids are friends. Like we try to help each other and everything. It's it's a great adventure to have your own business, um, to be able to create something like these these different menu items that no one would ever think about. Oh yeah. Um, to have them come to life and then to have people come back and say to you, you know, this was excellent, this was awesome. That is a reward in itself besides the monetary gain from having this as our job. Oh, so we need to talk about what's in front of us because this was amazing. Tell us again what this dish is. This is the Caribbean pulled pork mac and cheese. So this is our um, mac and cheese base and then on top of it we have the pulled pork. We have, um, a, it's a tangy barbecue sauce blend, mangoes, pineapples, French onions, and then an applewood seasoning. Oh. It was killer. That Thank was you. really good, I Jamie. I have so many people come back and say, I never would have thought to put these ingredients on mac and cheese, and it was just absolutely delicious. And that's why I love the adventure of the flavors, and I love the customers that come up, and they, they like to try the, you know, the different flavors, and it's, it's an adventure, and I, I love my customers. They're yeah. great. <laughs> oh, I bet they. I mean, you have something for everybody. Yeah. What's this? Buffalo chicken? This is our best seller, and I stumbled upon this because... I was at the college, um, CCAC, where I actually teach at also, because after I got my degree, they asked me to teach, which was really cool. Shout out to CCAC, they're great. Um, so I actually was requested to make this, and once I started making it, I put my own flair to it. I can't get rid of it, it's my best seller, like, so I had <laughs> to keep good. it. But it's the American Buffalo Chicken Dip Nachos. We have nachos, we have a creamy cheese sauce, then we have a blend of four shredded cheeses, then on top of that, we have our in-house made buffalo chicken dip, secret recipe, can't tell you what it is, sorry. Oh. <laughs> and then on top of that, we have um, uh, roasted red peppers, we have banana peppers, we have the French's onions, we have wing sauce and wing dust. Wow, that yeah. is a very great combination. <laughs> I'm gonna try that. Well, you tell us about the tacos over sure. here. <laughs> These are our Mexican street tacos. So they are the traditional corn shell. We grill them on the grill. And then we have a spring mix of lettuce. We have a blend of four cheeses, um, grilled steak, corn, uh, red onions, jalapenos, and a creamy sriracha sauce with smoked paprika. Oh man, <laughs> Jamie, this all looks amazing. And your kids are beautiful. I know they're a big help too. Yeah, yeah. Gotta check them out everybody, Mobile Chef. Where could they find you? 
Uh, next will be next Wednesday will be in uh, Moon Park for a concert. Ooh, yeah, ooh. concert in the park. So Love definitely it. check us out there. All right, next Wednesday, and make sure to follow both Mobile Chef and Mama Licious on their Facebook, Twitter, Instagram. They're all over, and they'll also be updating where they'll be. I mean, this stuff is really good. I I got a great day here being out <laughs> <laughs> for PDL Food Truck Week. Okay. I don't know if there's a pretty way to eat this. I don't even care. You guys know I love to eat. <laughs> Go for it. So, oh, yes. Hey! Oh, bravo. Yes. <laughs> oh, we love it. It hey, looks fantastic. What did that study say about people who eat nachos for breakfast? I don't think it said anything about people who eat nachos for breakfast, but I'm all for it. We're coming out. We're joining you at 10 o'clock, Selena. I cannot wait. Looks good. Come on out. Okay, great. I love the backstories here, and it's just, I love seeing the kids there with them. Right. I, I, I To hear a successful outcome of someone who takes a gamble yeah. and takes, puts the money forward to start a truck like that, they're just great stories and, and great food. And I mean, she took the time this morning to thank her dad and to give a shout yes. out to CCAC who helped her in her education. So She's I very love grateful. Yeah. And you said to me during the segment that girls love nachos, and I said boys love nachos too. <laughs> they probably do. We're going to have some nachos later, I think. <laughs> All right, well, to find out where Mobile Chef World Fusion will be or any of the trucks that you've seen this week, just head to our website, PittsburghTodayLive.com. We have all the information for you.